Welcome back guys, another customization video and in this video I'm going to show you two things. Actually, the first one you can see right on the screen. Fun fact, the second one is also on the screen. So, custom widgets and also custom One UI 8.5 inspired Samsung icons. And I'm just showing you some of them like my files and Bixby and the store and clock and good luck calendar, the gallery, pay attention also the new gallery assistant icon made it in this icon pack. Samsung helped, a lot of the good luck modules have custom icons and this is the application, it's called One UI 8.5 icons. 1428 custom icons, you can see all of them here, the system icons are there. The system icons are there like Galaxy Knox and messages and yeah, whatnot settings as well. Then we have the Google icons and then we have all the icons and this is how it really looks in reality. So I just installed it. By the way, this application also thus supports some custom wallpapers, which is also what I'm using right now. Not so much, but very fancy. And this is the creator, Fatih Mahmoud. So you can go on Play Store. It's going to be Apixo Studio. All right. So this is One UI. 8.5 icons this costed me like one euro and i also installed right now even for free the glass lab widgets which is also something that i'm using uh, right now on my screen and i'm going to show you how this thing works because it requires also the usage of another application and it's very uh, well known it's the kwgt all right this is the custom widget maker so in order for you to be able to activate some of these nice widgets you need to install it and then configure it. And besides the fact that it looks kind of cool, you can also click here and yep, get access to my AccuWeather. So yeah, you can modify your experience with the phone. This is the social, Telegram and Messenger and Facebook. Everything redesigned. Those are my media icons. As you can see, yeah, not great adoption. Some of them are not redesigned, but unit music is there. And then here guys, I do have all the Google icons, as you can see. Google icons, almost all of them are redesigned, Vase is not. And then of course here we have the stock items. I also do have a folder with the Samsung icons I just show you. So yeah, a lot of them really are redesigned. And if you wanna check all the icons, you can find them inside the application. Something that I really, really like, right? You can use this, I guess, on other phones as well with some other launchers. If you have Samsung One UI, then you need to use Steam Park. I really like the fact that they have included a guide. And if you are using Samsung phones, you need to start Good Luck and then open Steam Park. You need to create a new preset and then load the custom icons, save them as a preset, and then just hit the preset and apply them just like this. Hit here, it's gonna be apply. You're gonna apply them and then you get all these new icons so yeah this is it guys this is not one year 8.5 it's just inspired one year 8.5 so if you want to check this application i'm going to leave a link down below again i'm going to show you how this works all right i'm going to remove this i'm going to click here i'm going to click widgets and then here i'm just going to go for the kwgt i'm going to add it uh, and then move it to my home screen all right and then guys from here i can resize it then i'm gonna click and the kwgt app is gonna launch i'm gonna use the glass uh widgets right now so let's just go for something that is fancy just like that for example and yep i'm this is now on the screen and from here guys if you want to start some apps you can go to touch and here on the custom action you can just launch an application then you can select the app you want you can save the preset and then okay let's just launch Ampere for a reason all right now i'm gonna try to save it I'm gonna try to make this like that, save, and now when I click here, boom, you know, my Empyrea app will launch. So this is a very nice, and I do believe straightforward way for you to modify your home screen experience. Yeah, the cons is that the KWGT Pro costs something like four euro, and this thing is gonna cost you like one euro, but okay, yeah, we need to support the devs out there. So we're gonna check those apps, guys. I'm gonna leave a link down below, and if you like content like this, just go and check some of my previous videos. Stay safe, you're over and bye.